Hello, this is Dr. Michael Greger coming to you live from my treadmill, as I do every month to answer any questions you may have. For those of you unfamiliar with my work every year, I read through every issue of every English language nutrition journal in the world, so busy folks like you don't have to. And I compile the most interesting, most uh, groundbreaking, most practical findings to new videos and articles I upload nearly every day to my nonprofit site, nutritionfacts.org. Of course, now... My research juggernaut is uh, turned from chronic disease pivoting to uh, COVID-19. Uh, just in the last 24 hours, 358 articles were published um, uh, in the National Library of Medicine on this disease, not to mention the hundreds of preprints every day. But uh, our team is going through each and every one of those. We uh, just did a four-hour webinar. We're going to do another four-hour webinar May 27th on COVID-19. I have a new book coming out on how to survive a pandemic on ebook and audiobook next month. Uh, you can pre-order it now at nutritionfacts.org slash COVID-19. That's COVID-19. All proceeds I see from my books, of course, donated to charity. Um, what else uh, going on? We just did a couple hours of Q&As um, and uh, months of videos on COVID-19 coming up as well. So stay tuned for those. Let's get to your questions. Sheep work says, uh, why does Dr. McDougall say a vitamin D supplements are bad and can cause cancer? You would have to ask Dr. McDougall. All I can tell you is what the peer-reviewed science suggests. Um, Jay Hayford says, what can I eat to help my hair? It's very damaged. Uh, I take meds and am over 50. Well, it's like saying, what should I eat uh, to... Uh, to, uh, you know, I keep stubbing my toe, what should I eat? Well, you stop stubbing your toe. So if, your hair, if you're damaging your hair, stop damaging your hair. There are certainly nutrients that you need for optimal health growth, but uh, if you're eating a wide variety of whole plant foods, then you should be getting all the micronutrients you need. Emma says, how do I stop bloating? Well, 